What's up, gang? Back here again with another Kanaguru vape review. Today we're going to be reviewing Diablo OG. Still in the box, as you can see. Haven't opened it yet, and I am very excited. This one's going to be a little quick review today. Don't have the luxury of time on my side. Shout out to Seago as well. They make an awesome battery. Some people will be like, oh, what's so amazing about it? Well, your vape goes away. Same time, it protects it if it falls, you know? It won't just immediately smash on the ground. I've lost over a hundred bucks from bullshit like that. And it comes out kind of like a switchblade. It has a nice little release button. You push that, just flips right on out. But yeah, let's go ahead and try this. It's an off rip. It's kind of like a fruity flavor. It tastes kind of like White Widow. It tastes, it tastes kind of just like White, White Widow. Not bad though. It's good. Now it's starting to taste a little fruity. Er, can't pinpoint that fruit exact. I want to say juicy fruit. What does juicy fruit specifically taste like? And don't say a fruit. <laughs> um, but yeah, this one's not a bad one. Um, <coughs> uh, I would probably call this second or third tier. Not top tier, first tier like Skywalker OG or Gelato, for example. But it's not a bad one to pick up. Uh, Diablo seems like it has potential. Uh, just gets outclassed by other flavors. Yep. Not bad. Alright guys, well I gotta get to work. Uh, thanks for the view. The views. <laughs> 